Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Andrea and on today's video I want to talk to you about training college. I wanted to do this video for a long time and I've never managed to, to know how to do it or because it's such a long process. There's a, there's a lot of things to say about training college. So it's going to be quite a long video I believe so I would recommend you to take some tea, some coffee, water. I took water because I think I'm going to be very thirsty. Uh, it's gonna be a lot to say about this. Hopefully it's gonna be very interesting for you and let's get into the video. Before I talk to you about training college, I just wanted to remind you that I did a video uh, two years ago about Emirates recruitment. So I'm just going to put a link down here. I think it's somewhere here. And you can click on it. Just stop this video, click on it, watch this video if you still haven't done any assessment day. And then you can come back at this because this is the next video. So for those of you who have a code and called, congratulations and for those of you who are just interested about what's gonna happen next or if you don't want to be a crew but you're just interested about how is it going on in Emirates uh, how is it going on in the training college of Emirates well that's what we're going to talk about I'm already thirsty mm. by the way I just sat down in my bedroom I hope you like it I just I was just a bit tired of always sitting down on my couch uh, so this is like kind of a new thing and I'm just waiting as well I'm just gonna put like some uh, decoration here on the wall so I'm just waiting for my delivery which I'm really excited about but this is not what the video is about it's about training college so when you arrive in Dubai just to let you know in Dubai the weekends are Friday and Saturday usually it's uh, Saturday and Sunday but here it's Friday and Saturday so it means that you're gonna come to Dubai in one of those days I arrived in Dubai on a Friday it was the 13th of May 2016 but I believe the process will still be the same in 2020 so, uh, so you're gonna you're gonna arrive in Dubai you're gonna land and then uh, I was very lucky because I came with two of my really good friends we did the open days together like we were in Paris during the open day together and then we joined at the same day and we were in the same batch so it's like the same class so we were very lucky and we were in the same airplane because we joined together it means that we're so we were in the same airplane so you're gonna go through an airplane you're not gonna pay for anything Emirates is gonna take care of everything they're gonna send you a plane ticket you go to Dubai a team is gonna be there to welcome you and then they will divide you into your accommodations uh, I believe you already know which accommodation you are into because they sent it to you but if you're new to Dubai obviously you have no idea where is it uh, because I arrived on a Friday my Saturday was off and I I called my friend because I had no memory absolutely no memory about what um, what happened on that day I don't remember this day didn't exist didn't exist in my life sorry um, and apparently she told me that yeah like Saturday we were off and we went to the Dubai mall for the first time I was like oh really we did no I, I don't remember a thing about this but okay so I know that the first time that I visited the Dubai mall um, was on the 14th of May uh, 2016 that's good to happen is that on Sunday everybody's gonna go to the headquarters of Emirates which is which we call the HQ this is where all the manager are and basically this is the big 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 office of Emirates this is basically where all everything is happening where all the work is happening and this is also where you're gonna go check in and check out of your flight when you will be flying of course um, so on Sunday there will be a bus picking you up from your accommodation um, this bus is gonna bring you up to the HQ and then on the second floor of the HQ this is the only part I believe that uh, any visitors can can go to and there there is a big massive auditorium and this is where you're gonna spend I believe your first week everything that I'm gonna try to tell you guys it's not a hundred percent sure it might it might not be the same for you as right now in the year that you're gonna watch this video but I think it's gonna be similar and because I'm crew it's been like almost four years that I've done this it's been a long time I try to refresh my memories by watching other videos 
I want to thank actually Mary from the channel uh, Traveling Black Mary and also Kata from the from the channel Katasia Gonzalez. I'm gonna put those two here because they did similar videos to this one and I took information that I was uh, missing because to be honest it's very hard to remember all of this so thank you to you girls so thank you very much to you girls for being able to help me for this video and also thank you to my friends who reminded me a lot of things because i forgot and also in the rest was for me from this sunday you will have a full week which is called a induction week and this is where you're going to learn a lot of things guys all the information that you need to know is going to they're going to send you they're going to send you a lot of information is going to be a lot of things to take in so I would say like bring uh, a booklet or paper so you can write everything down and I remember that they will bring you some papers as well but yeah it's gonna be a lot a lot a lot a lot of information so um, good luck so yeah be prepared and it's not really it's not gonna be the start of really training college of your course and when you're gonna be like actually like learning stuff from school let's say uh, it's gonna be a lot of information uh, this is where they're gonna put you into your batches so this is the exciting part so our batch is like our little class classroom let's say so you're gonna might you're gonna make your batch mates hopefully they will be nice and good uh, I had an amazing batch I remember um, we were a uh, six French speaker I think which is something really rare also something that was really good is like we had more boys than girls which is something that usually never happens it's usually much more girls and boys but we had like I think we had nine nine boys for seven girls or something like this. I don't remember the, the numbers but yeah definitely we had more boys so it was quite fun less drama to be honest during this week you will be introduced to your batch as i say you will be introduced to your managers and you need to know something that you need to know about this week is that uh for the first day you will have to rem to wear a um formal outfit you will have to use uh black pants for the girls and boys and then a white uh blouse um for the first day and then they will give you the famous very famous red t-shirt uh, so then you will only wear your black uh, your black pants so I recommend you to bring a lot of black pants like three or four so you can change them and uh, and then you will and then you will wear the red uh, t-shirt on top I believe on the second day which is gonna be Monday uh, this is the day I believe that you will get your money uh, it's not gonna be much guys uh, that's why I recommend if you can bring a little bit of money ahead uh, from from home gonna be easier because if I remember correctly you will only get 2,500 dirhams which is not which is not much so it will help you definitely to buy the stuff that you need for your home and to get to obviously um, get your food uh, and obviously to eat I really recommend you to bring a little bit of money not too much as well but a little bit of money with you it's just in case something happens um, at this point you will not be uh, able to open a bank account yet because uh, you will need a lot of documents in order to do that which you will be preparing all those documents during, the, during this um, induction week uh, you will not be able to open a bank account straight away and you will not be able to get internet straight away which is another point that is really important because you need all your documents to do so as I said when I arrived in, uh, usually, usually when you arrive in your accommodation, you have flight mates. So your flight mates have been there for quite some time and internet should be there in the house. When I arrived into my accommodation, my flight, I had a flight mate, but she was not living in the accommodation. She was, she was never there, so there was no internet. And which was really a big struggle for me is that I couldn't buy internet. I couldn't, pr I couldn't buy internet straight away because of those because i had to wait to get those documents done so yeah definitely bring a little bit of money because i had to buy a lot of uh, a lot of money on those uh, sim cards for the phone so that i can use internet or just call my parents so yeah i would say bring a little bit of money because what they give you is still it's good but it's not enough as i said you need documents and this is the those those documents you will prepare them during this week the main document that you will receive is your visa uh, you will have to prepare for the visa so the legalities for having a visa in Dubai you will have to do a blood test chest x-ray and I, re I remember we, d we went to do our fingerprints as well 
a lot of things uh, a lot of things that you will have to do uh, for those of you who have not completed all the um, all the vaccinations needed I remember we went as well to the clinic there we have a private clinic for flight attendants and pilots uh, in the HQ as well and this is where you're gonna do everything when you're done with all the documentation you will go to training college uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel like this video and